guys um i just got this calendar in the mail from amazon today and um i wanted to show you guys what it looked like inside it's the one that Corey the reset girl uses and i thought it would be great for me um to take to work and use it um uh, but I couldn't really find any good pictures or walkthroughs or really anything on uh, YouTube. So I thought I would just go ahead and film this real quick. So you can get an idea of what it looks like and see if it's something that might be, uh, you know, useful for you as well. So it says that each month is followed by um, a color coordinated page with a call log, coupons, and other fun stuff. And it does start, um, well, let's see. Now this is the 17 month work it desk jotter. So it does start with August, which obviously we're already in, but this is really cool. I like this. So it has need to do, wants to do, and then a little bit worry about it next month um what do you see in your future some stuff for projects urgent how full is the glass this month and it does have holidays including banks uh your weekends are on the side so it starts sunday and goes through saturday And then this is the second page here, and it has call log, um, important notes, you can doodle, official from the desk, and some coupons that you could, you know, give to people throughout the month. I did, this is really neat, I like this. I don't make a whole lot of calls, but um, I think that uh, I could definitely use that for something. So each month then has some different things down here. Um, I like that they all say fresh start. Well, this one says fresh start as well. But it does have the need to do, want to do, and the projects. So it's pretty much the same. I do like that. The top things. I just may or may not be important. Okay. And there's October. Let me just I'm gonna take this all out. Okay. They're pretty much the same. So this one says things I'm totally excited to do. Okay. Good mood. I'm definitely going to um, keep some of these that I can't use. So, and that says finally <laughs> for the end of the year, probably. This gift's for you. They all have this instant good mood. And there's nothing on the back, so you could write whatever you wanted to. Okay, has a place for some uh, New Year's resolutions. This year you'll get organized. Some different ones. In February, do more of what makes you awesome. Relax and take notes by moonlight. Seem to all have the projects from what I can see. Yeah. And then the need to do what to do or want to do's. And call logs. March says happy accidents can't happen if you're careful. So these are usually different. Uh, they all say clean slate. And this is pretty much the same. It does have. Um, you know, daylight savings and all the 
holidays on here. I like the colors, they're very nice. And it does say the month and year at the top. I'm just going to go through these really quick. You can always pause it if there's one that you wanted to take a better look at. The paper is a nice quality, so I think I could actually use you know several types of markers. We'll test that here in a minute. So lots of places to write down things that are going on for the month. And I like how pretty it is. It's not, you know, that boring white, you know, desk calendar that um, you get work at work. I think that I paid um, around 15 for it on Amazon. I'll check. So, the very last is a page about her, and it gives her some information about some other things that she has that I might have to look into. Alright. So, this is what it all looks like again. It does have the corners here for you to put it into. I do want to test the... Um, paper quality so let's get some pens this is my um, Tombow pen I use uh, let's just test it okay. it didn't bleed through so that's good let's try a paper mate flare. I'm just writing my name. And then we can, let's see, try one of these high tech uh, C pens. Um, how about a Sharpie marker. I know some of you like to use Sharpies. Grab one. Maybe. Okay, I'm not sure where my Sharpies are. Um, where are my Sharpies? Alright, and then we'll try a Stetler. see what else we can find to try out. I don't know what I did with my Sharpies. Maybe they're in here. That would be negative. <laughs> so we tried Stedler's. Um, friction, I doubt, will bleed through, but we'll try that. I have these uh, watercolor pens. 
Oh, there's my Sharpies. Right where I thought I had them. Okay, there's the Sharpie. You might want to uh, color on it if you're gonna doodle. We can try a um, distress marker. Let's even try out some ink. Um, okay. Let's give some ink a shot. Let's just use this. I'm not worried about chalk ink. I know that chalk usually doesn't fade. But we'll see how well this stays on works. this month. Okay, let's just try some chalk or some magic chalk ink. Okay, I think that covers all those. Now let's flip it and check it out. Really, the only thing that went through was the Sharpie and the uh, stays on, but it did not bleed to the other page, so I think it's safe to say that you could pretty much write with anything on this and you would not have to worry about it bleeding through to your next month. I mean, I used just about every pen that you could think of. I mean, even a highlighter. And I like that. So if you wanted to stamp something or write anything you wanted, it would work out really well. You could draw, doodle, and then these have the perforated lines so you can cut them out and give them. I'm going to save all the ones for this month that I can't use. So I hope that, oh, I was going to tell you how much I paid for it. So it was on Amazon. And, um, let's see, I really think it was only a couple, like 15 maybe. I know that, um, there's probably several places that you can get it, but I have, uh, free, you know, two day prime. So I, uh, I like to use my Amazon if I can get here real quick. And I think that uh, you could probably put your washi tapes or whatever you wanted on here and they, they would look nice. Um, so I bought it on Amazon for $14.20, um, $14 but it's now $16.70, um, or $14.25 and now it's $16.70, so you know how that, that goes. Keep an eye on it and I'm sure it will go back down. Um, Let's, we can check the um, sizes of the boxes if you would like um, to see how big stickers would fit in it, but these, um, you know, quote, quote stickers, um, I, I mean, you can see the, di the boxes aren't that bad. I mean, you could probably use some of your stickers um, from different things in there and it would be great. I think that it would help you stay organized at work. So I think between that calendar and my, uh, you know, do it now, do it later pad, I'm going to be good for this, this next year at work. Well, I hope that, like I said, I hope this video was uh, useful for you. And um, if you have any questions, 
about certain pens, I'll gladly try them out. Thanks.